I sometimes feel that the tarnished image of bodybuilding is the main reason for the sport being confined to relatively narrow demographics. Bodybuilding seems to be pursued seriously by two separate cohorts. There are those who ape the professionals and think that it would be really cool to look massive, um, imposing and vascular and freaky. And some of them will even take drugs to that end and thereby risk getting sick. The other bunch of people are savvy folk who value bodybuilding for all the healthy and liberating reasons that we've been talking about. They'd never be tempted to take performance enhancing substances because the drug habit negates the healthy benefits, the, you know, the health benefits of, 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 of lifting and a lot of the aesthetic benefits as well. Our uh, demographic, let's call it our, ours, <laughs> has no inclination to take on the exaggerated mass and vascularity of the pros. Because of this schism, the sport lacks the kind of integrity and innocence that I envy with cycling or volleyball, where people of all levels of education gladly rub shoulders with anyone who demonstrates talent and interest in the sport. There's no suspicion that they might be in cycling or volleyball for the wrong reasons. An activity that should bind people of different backgrounds ends up setting them apart. You prefer not to associate yourself with folk who inject hormones in order to gain an intimidating physique. It seems sordid and abject, not only dangerous and unsustainable, but contrary to the purpose. You sometimes feel a need to dissociate yourself from the dark side when talking to friends who don't lift and who might wonder why you'd have cultivated such a bizarre interest. So instead of solidarity among lifters, you have suspicion and shame where lifters are alienated from one another as if playing a different sport. One contingent looks at the other as if naive noobs who get nowhere and the latter view the former with disgust and contempt for betraying the noble purpose and innocent spirit of this ancient pursuit. As much as I'd like to feel a rapport with fellow lifters, I don't have much in common with the opposite number and I'd figuratively cross the street to avoid the dark taint of drug abuse. And they, perceiving my tiny muscle mass, would react in turn with the same disregard. <laughs>